today is going to be quite fun. I have this mold here that my mom got me and well we haven't tried it yet. It has really cute um, birds on it. Little love birds, you know. So first I gotta figure out how much oil I'm gonna need. So I looked up some information on the internet the other day and this is what I found out. Cubic inches times um, of the mold times 0.4 equals the amount of oil that we'll need for soap. So we need to figure that out. All right, so we have here um, the inches of our ruler here measures two and a half by, hmm, oh, that's a little bit wider than two and a half, 2.75, and the depth is about 0.75. So that means we're going to multiply 2 and um, 3 fourths, that's what that is, times 2.5 and then times 0.75 because that's how deep it is here. Let's do that. Times point seventy five. So it is five. The total of that of the cubic square inches is five point fifteen cubic inches. Now we have to multiply that by point four. Okay. <clears throat> And we have, really? Wow. Two point, okay, so I'm, ju I'm just gonna, it says 2.06. Um, I'm gonna make it 210 just to be on the safe side. Wow, so just two ounces, really? Oh, that's right, I forgot. Okay, now this makes more sense. We need to multiply this by six. Well, I'll just go with a 2.06 times six of the of the cavities there okay now that makes more sense so we're gonna need 12 and if I round up it would be 12.4 ounces 12.4 ounces of oil okay so I'll use the lie calculator that I use to figure out my recipe Okay, so now I'm going to put 4.25 ounces of water, uh, which I'll do ice, with 1.7 ounces of lye. I measured out the palm kernel and the coconut oil. I'm going to take it over here into the kitchen and put it in the double boiler. Turn that heat off there. So Brambleberry sends free samples, and this is the vanilla oak that I um, got and I think that'll work out pretty perfectly for this small amount I don't know how much is in there but I need about 0.5 ounces so that should cover it okay let the fun begin got my protective goggles and my gloves although I like to use the blue ones a lot of times but these are less expensive I just feel like I have to be more careful because they're a little I don't know, it feels like they could let things through a little bit more. At least in my opinion, I don't know if it's true. But. All right.
That was perfect. And Okay, so I put the red in the wings, and then now I want to put yellow in all these little birdies. They're kissing each other, so cute. Ooh, I hope we're not setting up already. I better work a little faster. Oh, now I'm making a mess because I'm panicking. You want to see what I'm doing? I've never done artwork with my soap this intricately. This is like very intricate for what I usually do. Oh, so there's yeah. a little red wing. I already put the red in with that little bag there. So I'm interested to see what you're going to make when you play with the soap. I've always been interested in doing that. Um, swirls. Okay. Well, you're the one who got me, you really helped me get into this. I'm not even sure who thought of it first, exactly. Are you just on the same page or something? Well, I remember mentioning it and you said, that's exactly something that I wanted to do. Some, something, yeah, like the kind of thing I would like or whatever. Yeah. Well, that, that worked out. Look out, Paw Patrol. Yeah, and they're, they're just doing something, and they said, Hey, get out of my spot. Okay. And he was mad at them. Oh. Let's see. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, now I need a little tissue to clean up my uh, artwork. I have to no. You're winner of the champion, huh? Yeah, I'm winner! I'm winning already! Yay! Um, no, you didn't! <laughs> Yay, I won! No, you didn't! I win! Did I put the wrong All right. thing? <clears throat> now, hey! look at this. Oh, hey, it's starting to set hey, out. Hey, hey, oh, no. It's not what I want. Oh, boy. So I did, got a few ready here, but that that didn't, uh, the poor little birdie head's gone there. And this one, well, one birdie's head is there. So, uh, this one, the birds are intact, but the hearts are not, you know, like, like those have nice hearts, but there's one bird head missing and... These birds' heads are there, but the heart wings are not so much there. So let's see if, if we're going to do better on this one. Let's try. Maybe I should get them out with more patience. 
and work very carefully here on these little birdie heads. And it might have even helped to wait another day. Oh, that one popped out pretty nicely, actually. I'm encouraged. Yesterday when I tried to get them out, it just, it was like, oh no, is this going to even work? But I put them in the freezer um, overnight, and then for most of the day, I took them out today. It's been out for a little while, but I don't know if it was just more time or freezer time or what, but it worked out. And... Yeah, so so the, this is intact, but my little heart wings are just not little enough. I put too much red on there. I definitely want to try this again because I can learn from how it went and how to do better and see if I like the recipe I made for this one, too, because I made up a new recipe for this. Um, that one came out okay. So, uh, there's probably two that I really like, these two. This one's headless. This one has too, too much uh, red on the wings. Too much red on the wings, and this one has one head right. So, <laughs> so that was for fun, and um, I think I want to try that again sometime and learn from my mistakes.